So what do you think plug-in car advocates can do besides buy the car? Well, I think plug-in advocates, uh, right now for, for the Volt, they can buy the car, but um, even better is the upcoming Via truck, which has the base, same technological base. In fact, there's a former senior Volt engineers working with Via, and now you've got a full-size pickup truck or sport utility or a full-size van with 40 miles electric and then a small gasoline engine driving the generator set. And we shouldn't forget that these big vehicles are really America's vehicle of choice, you know, right. rightly or wrongly, but people love the big stuff. If you can get the big stuff to a sort of 100 mile per gallon average, hmm. uh, that th there it really makes sense because uh, VIA can demonstrate that for a fleet user, the combination, uh, the monthly combination of amortizing the cost of the truck plus fuel is going to be less, the sum, the sum of those two is going to be less than for a conventional vehicle. So now mm -hmm. the numbers people who look at it say, well, wait a minute, you know, I, I don't necessarily buy into this global warming thing, but holy smoke, this thing makes sense just looking at the numbers. Right. And once you've got that, that's the breakthrough. Right. When, when a vehicle of this type becomes cheaper to own and operate than a conventional fueled vehicle, that's when, that's when it tips. Right. To find out how you can benefit from plug-in electric cars and trucks, go to pluginamerica.org.